Right, just a quick update on the, the six foot tank. I've taken the water out. <clears throat> the test was successful. No water leaked at all, it's like a few days later. So I've took all that water out. It's um, So that test was successful. I've got this corrugated plastic. I had this, I watched the uh, King of DIY. He does tanks and everything on YouTube and he mentioned about cutting this corrugated plastic for a roof. So I've done that. I've got it in different sections. That's spot on. Really happy with that. Um, I've ordered the uh, heater for inside, 300 watt one. Um, so that should be along soon. I've also now got through the post my um, sand. I ordered normal sand. Well, sand that goes in tanks. <clears throat> I've ordered that, so I've got to give that a wash. Um, but obviously I won't be doing that until I start setting the tank up. But I'm getting there. Um, the sponge filter upstairs has been in my little tank with the piranha in. It's been in there now about a, about a week, just over a week. So I'm only a few days away from getting this tank sorted filled up and get the sponge filter in i should have the like i said the heater through um later next week so it all will happen um but i'm really pleased about the water not leaking that was really good news that's a bit i was really worried about um but yeah it should all happen soon it's just as well because the piranha are getting quite a bit bigger and they're sort of tearing chunks out of each other a little bit. Um, I'm still on an iron whether to... I, I might be buying another one, a bigger one. And have the tank in sections. Maybe up to there. For the little ones. And the rest of the tank. For one big one. But I'm still trying to decide about that. <coughs> But things are going well so far. That's the tank update.